Welcome back for another unboxing swatch video. Today we're going to be looking at the Faber-Castell Albrecht Dürer watercolor pencil set of 24. These are made in Germany and are a very high-end watercolor pencil. So let's take a quick look around the box. We've got what appears to be, uh, well, I guess the anatomy of a pencil up here, uh, what we can expect to see, and uh, a couple of different languages with some information. So Great Britain, English, uh, high quality acid free pigments, bright colors, soft, vibrant lay down, fully water soluble lead, 3.8 millimeter lead, high break resistance due to secure bonding process, which is uh, actually something pretty unique. They basically glue the lead into the pencil, which means if it falls, the lead will not slip out on you when you're sharpening it, which is really nice. And then while we're back here, you can see that uh, the light fastness ratings are also uh, put up there. Three stars means maximum light fastness, and the majority of these have three stars. Only a couple have two, which is high light fastness. So we have this um, 115 over here, 107, and 180, and the rest are three star. At those ratings, these colors aren't going anywhere anytime soon. Those colors are rated for artist use, and they are uh, ACMI certified non-toxic. So all good stuff. Let's see what is in the case. Now this is a metal tin. And it looks like we have a nice little bit of information about Faber and the company, founded in 1761. Traditional Faber-Castell company produces artist materials of an unsurpassable quality to satisfy the highest demands. We have some paperwork in here. Uh, looks like there's a little bit more reading uh, in several different languages. Let's see if there's any additional color charts. Oh, it looks like it's instead of a color chart, what you have here are all the colors. So we have just a 24 piece set. Uh, these look like they're all the colors that are available um, in their entire line. And then it looks like some other accoutrement that might go well. This is like a water cup that can pop up, their water brush, their sharpener, all that good stuff. And then some of the other sets that they carry. So these pencils are fairly large. Uh, let me just pull one out here. So as you can see, made in Germany, these pencils are larger than a traditional watercolor pencil when you think of a watercolor pencil like a colored pencil or just like a regular graphite pencil. You have this certain standard size in mind. These are definitely larger with the 3.8 millimeter lead. Uh, so you get a lot of color in there. Really nice uh, color name on the back. We'll be sure to put the color names while we're swatching those out. So let me get my uh, watercolor paper out and ready, and we'll start uh, talking about how we're going to lay these out. All right, so we have our paper laid out here. I'm going to be going through each of the pencils, and I'm going to be applying, well, unfortunately, we're going to be starting with the white, which doesn't always show up the best, as uh, if you've been following our unboxing swatches, you uh, know. But I'm going to be applying a thick layer, and then I'm going to kind of ease up on the pressure to about half, uh, half the pressure, and then we're going to do all of the pencils dry, and then I'm going to come back in again with a brush, and we'll see how they activate with water. So let's get started. Before I go ahead and add the water, I just have to address these pencils and how they laid down the color. It's a very, very unique experience, and I mean that in an extremely positive way. They are firm, you know, stiff, but they are also extremely smooth, and that is very, it's even complex to try to describe it. The uh, color laid down very well, as you can see, all these pencils came pre-sharpened. At certain points I was concerned that you know a tip might snap because I was putting down heavy pressure. Nope, they did not snap. The pencil was resilient and they added the color absolutely beautifully. That was one of the most unique experiences I've ever had laying down watercolor pencil. For this demonstration I'll be using the Mimic Kalinske round size 6.
So I've laid all my colors down and there are certain things that I want you to notice, there are certain nuances that make this set really special. You can see that anywhere that the water touched, regardless of how hard or heavy handed I was with the pencil, it, it, it was completely water soluble. I mean, this looks like it was taken from a watercolor pan, not a watercolor pencil. These colors laid down beautifully, they stayed very vibrant. These colors at this point um, are mostly dry. And you can see that even the black has stayed very, you know, dark. Uh, sometimes they will lighten up as they dry. So really pigmented, really beautiful, very water soluble. Uh, really, I don't think that I would be able to tell the difference if you showed this to me of whether it was a watercolor pencil or a watercolor pan. All I would know is they were high-end watercolors because these colors sing. So thank you for joining us for this unboxing swatch. If this was helpful, please be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel to see future unboxing swatches. We'll see you on the next one.